Did that guy just say revenge is a dish best served cold? The Revengers. Everyone else called them the Revengers. What it do, Revenger crew? What is the haps on the craps? Listen, if it's your first time coming through the channel, man, welcome. We're really thrilled to have you. We are the ESMR Revengers, and we do reaction videos from all around the globe. I am one of the hosts on this channel. My name is Bo, and you can catch me on your Instagram application at Merrill Productions. That's M E R R I L L Productions. You can also catch me on Twitter at Merrill Product One. More often than not, I am joined by my fantastic wife. She's the GOAT. You can catch her on Instagram as well. A N W Triple E Z Triple Y. Enough of that. Check it out. So we do a lot of reaction videos on this channel. All right. If you've ever visited us before, thanks for coming back. We got about 600 videos under our belt right now. All across the board, man. Egyptian hip hop, Moroccan hip hop, the UK hip hop, Italian hip hop, Japanese hip hop. If it's out there, we review it, man. Korean hip hop. We do it all. OK. And not just hip hop too. Shouts to Lil Mix, shouts to Pentatonix, shouts to the the Lil Mixes, the Pentaholics, all of y'all. So I wanted to do something because I'm I'm a, I'm a hardcore rap guy. I love rap. I love all music, but rap is my thing. I wanted to go back through all the Double XL classes, and you know, because we don't give enough credit to Double XL. We act like Double XL hasn't put on a lot of fantastic artists because. In the last three or four years, the artists have been weaker. They've, they've found a lot of duds. They have. But that's part of it, man, because a lot of people don't blow, not because of their talent, because of their work ethic, because of their label situation. So I like what Double XL does with the freshmen, and I wanted to go back. They started the freshman thing in, like, 2007, I think, okay? It's 2020. That's a long time ago. And so I was trying to find all of these freestyles. I couldn't find a 2007 freestyle. Couldn't find a 2008, but I found 2009. So what I want to do is I want to go from 2009 to 2020 and go through all the freestyles, man. See what's hot. See what's not hot and talk about it. And it's really endearing to do this for me because I'm 34 year old man. I lived through all of this. I know all these artists. It's so this is very, it's very familiar to me. So without further ado, we're going to check out the 2009 Double XL freshman. And let's give Double XL a lot of credit. They've come a long way. A lot of these look like they were shot in like apartment hallways. It's terrible. So let, let, let's have a little fun with this. I want to give you rappers a chance, though. If you're a freestyle artist, if you got bars, and if you don't, if you're just a singer, songwriter, whatever, we have a live stream every Saturday night at 8 o'clock Mountain Standard Time, okay? We have 20 to 30 singers, songwriters, engineers, producers, and people that know music, that really know the game of music that can help you improve your music. So send your slaps. Send your songs through us to us at esmr0775 at gmail.com. We will listen to your music. We'll react to it. And everybody in our live stream will give you commentary and we give scores based out of 100. So you can find out where you stand, how you can improve, and what you did right and wrong. All right, man, enough of the yappity yap yap yap. Let's get into this joint, man. Let's start with the double XL 2009 freshman freestyles. Let's start with Kid Cudi. Let's go. I'm off the nothing, sitting in my world in the coffee, 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 off the air from the curb. Money, money, money is what they could carry. Do they agree? What they might see could be not exactly what they thought. The card of the rap star allegedly bought is probably the same card of the rap star winning. Front in the tenant, supreme in the snowfish, tail in the wind. Parking lot at Applebee's clocked in, and my mouth saw up and down, and I'll be the next cometh. The all right, all right, all right, all right. <laughs> A couple things we need to talk about. Number one, the production value on this is garbage. Terrible. Number two, what is Cuddy saying? I like Cuddy. What's going on right now? Why are you rapping with a thing over your face? I know Cuddy has had some challenges, you know, um, maintaining his mental health and things like that. So I don't want to make fun of him, but how, how can this? He was like pre-COVID. He knew about COVID. He's like 10 years early, but he knew what was up. 
Mother niggas far from it, can't stand how these dick ride bandits Even get granted the excess, all up in the mix Wanna be a Kanye, wanna be a skateboard team But nigga, all the BBC cannot put you In the same place, they give you the same face Find you first and you can raise the stakes Higher, not talk of shit, just fire Please, motherfucker All this big shit I rock is none other You the best MCs in the groove Cash trip, the honor, trip in the realness And oh, how you gotta feel this Took a decade to just say I'm paid Took a ticket to also, Kid Cudi came out of Ohio, so let's give him credit for that. Not too many people get out of Ohio. It's him and Bone Thugs. Who else? Also, um, you could hear him a lot clearer if he had no no covering on. Like, also, what mic did they use? The mic attached to the camera? I mean, I guess it was 2009. I wasn't even using the internet like that in 2009, so I guess I can't knock him. Okay, the big girls are lay down, spread ego. Pop that pussy hole, meet the love below. I'm the champ that needs a gold medal. Styles of flow, homeboy, I got plenty. Picked up my needle, the digital vortex. Text in the free, digital phone sex. You want to step it down, because my sounds give me digital checks. Give your bites inside the words that I write. Get going, nigga, day and night. Huh, take a little relief. How more crystal clear can I be? How more crystal clear can I be? How more crystal clear can I be? And that wasn't a freestyle. That was a verse he wrote. He delivered it cool. You know, I... The thing about Cuddy is he doesn't... He's not a conventional rapper. You're not getting bars on bars on bars. He's not a push a T. You're going to get some broken up things. You're going to get some melodies. You're going to get some questions. It means unique and people love him and he's he's like a uh, he's like a cult icon and he should be like I like Cuddy a lot he that mm, he, he he brought some things that changed the game no doubt and actually Kid See Ghost is actually a pretty solid album. All right, let's go to the next one. The fighting spirit is one we all share. All right, so the fighting spirit, Modelo, shouts to Eduardo Perez. So yeah, do y'all rock with Kid Cudi like that? I think Kid Cudi is definitely a generational talent. You're not gonna get too many like him. The fact that he broke the mold and actually made it is crazy to me because he's so unique. All right, the next one is B.O.B. Everyone was saying hip hop was dead. It wasn't dead. These niggas just weren't making no bread because they scared to be real, so they faking instead. And when that happens, rapping ain't rapping, it's acting instead. <laughs> but like they say, it's just entertainment. And it's a game. So all these jokers is playing, even me. But what happens when the game changes? Your favorite rapper's gonna have to do some explaining. Okay. <laughs> that was actually pretty good, but. but but we got 26 seconds. What am I going to do with it? It actually sounded good. Let's talk about B.O.B. B.O.B. was way ahead of his his time. He signed a grand hustle, and he had a very successful run there. Strange Clouds, Nothing on You, Airplanes. He had some joints, but he got, you know, I noticed that sometimes when rappers actually ascend, they get weird, man. He got into the flat earth thing and he didn't really, he, he had to no genre, uh, run a mixtapes that I, I do feel like B.O.B. is a lot like Cuddy in the fact that they don't necessarily have a genre. They, they do transcend, but I don't understand why he fell off. He was really, B.O.B. was a, a, you know, B plus to a minus rapper. He was up there like and I say B plus the A minus in the pantheon of rappers where they, they you know where you have that level of success. He was up there. He was good. A couple more years he would have been an A rapper. He would have been a star but it just fell apart. And he had that joint with Bruno Mars nothing on you and that was at the the outset of Bruno Mars's career so they, they could have collabed more. I don't know what happened to B.O.B. man and I, I don't know why I only got 26 seconds but let's move on. Ace Hood is the next one. Abuela, tío, mom. And we getting we getting ads. Mom, little bro. We're gonna get ads on every single video, so that's not great. But in the meantime and in between time, Ace Hood, I ha I hear a lot of people like Ace Hood, but I don't know his his catalog like that. So if you're watching this, you're an Ace Hood fan, I can skip this one. Let me know in the comments so I can um get more familiar. Money more problems, they holler, I get them, I got them. How about a Bugatti, the beast, and I feast from the bottom. We're we gonna start this one over. 
More money, more problems, they holler, I get them, I got them. How about a Bugatti's the beast and I feast from the bottom? Young is in charge, feed them heat from the teeth of the lava. Ain't stopping them steady, my can leave you inside of a coffin. Boy, I am ace at the ace to the double OD. And when you mention greatness, boy, you better be mentioning me. And when you say the best, you definitely mentioning me. They said I couldn't do it, proving them ludicrous dudes who doubted the music. They influence is moving through me. I'm times three here, the feeling is deep in me. Call me young, hope the way I'm changing, I bang on the beat. My album drop and see the dead will be living through me. That means greatness is bigger than part of these that was cool, but whose idea was it to shoot this in black and white four inches from a silhouette of their profile? Th this was terrible. I mean, I guess at the time it was probably seen as unique, but this was garbage. The way this was shot was bad. And if I'm an executive, you bring this to me. I mean, maybe at the time you think this is cool, but like, how about we see their whole face? I don't know. This is supposed to be promotional for them. What did y'all think of that? I actually thought he sounded pretty good and like, had it actually been something that he didn't record sitting outside, it would have been great. But I don't know what the thought process behind this was. Let's move on. Maybe I can. Let's see if he has anything else. No. All right. Charles Hamilton. Charles Hamilton had one song and I can't remember the name of it. He, he didn't last long. He didn't. Blowing smoke from my mouth. Bandana on my eyes, but you know what I'm about. See, I'll be flowing from the south, which means from the bottom, my soles. You got them? Not my Nikes, can't walk in my shoes. I walk around talking the blues, living hip-hop, but rock is all in my news. So just listen to the new shit that I got to say. Signed to the same label as Dr. Dre. And I refuse to rock away. I don't have enough weight, right? So wait, right? While I refuse to write, cause I am way nicer than anyone that you put on my level. Look at my level. You can't look at sky level, cause I can't. Got a bandana on my eyes. God damn, I'm the man. Santana, you surprised? Another pink nigga from Harlem that came up on the rise. Look up, I'm in the sky. Look up to this guy. Matter of fact, look up this guy and see why I refuse to be the one that ever lies. You know my name. Double XL. First of all, no one knew your name. Second of all, I respect that as a freestyle. But not for this, okay? This is your one shot to put yourself on. I like the concept. This made more sense than the other ones, than the Cuddy joint, than the, uh, than the previous two joints where they, you know, you get to have Ace Hood silhouette. That stuff was... This is smart to me. Great marketing from XXL. You can still kind of see his face. It's in color, thank God. But why give this freestyle? Why not actually? And you know what? I, you know, now I'm thinking about it. Respect to Charles Hamilton. This is probably before dudes wrote their freestyles and called them freestyles. But he should have wrote this freestyle because it, it, it was actually off the top. So it was solid for an off the top joint. But if this is the thing that's going to push you to the next level, all eyes on you and this is what you deliver. I'm not I'm not impressed. All right, let's move on. Who we got next? We getting the ad? At American Public University. We getting the ad. Oh, shit. Nope. Oh. You said you were my dad. Oh, I messed up. Yeah. I, I messed up. America landed on the beaches. All right. Who Who is this one right now? Is this Asteroid? No. I don't know. This might be Asteroid. Anyway, so Charles Hamilton had one song, and he's from Harlem. Charles Harlem has great artists. Mace. Who else did he mention? Um, uh, Jewels. Uh, Dame Dash. Is from Harlem is a big influence on hip-hop. But uh, yeah, that wasn't it. Wale, okay. I love Wale. And I liked this era Wale. I liked ambition. I liked attention deficit. Attention deficit. Ooh. Attention deficit disorder. A lot of people didn't like that. I thought that was a good album. So I like this version of Wale. This is probably my favorite Wale version. So I'm very intrigued about this. And Wale has withstood the test of time. Shouts to, shouts to DC. Shouts to Wale. His career has gone up and down, but he came out the back end. Most of his music at this point is like more for females. It's relationship music, but it's good. He found a lane for himself similar to what Fabulous did. So I'm very excited for this. Let's check it out. I focus on the void and I feel it. Hoping the depressed ain't give in and give up. So listen this. Give up your ears, it's your hero. From hero on to hero on like high. I give off, lip off my lie, hear my lullaby. They itching for a new breath, here's the calamine. And I refuse to camouflage with other guys. You see my mind is the muse of their head, nah, and I so got them. Chicken over mambo, listening 
the mambo, instinct vocal sound better over Congos. My rhetoric is awesome, the less I just suppose. See, they know it's all for nonsense. Hope they put it on him. Most of us is on ends meet till the first and fifteenth. That we all dress like we want a contest or something. And those who overstep and get I dressed Albert in the street like the movie AG. I bring you uh where I'm from. I feel like that was very true to Wale. He said Get it. I think he mentioned Idris Elba in the street, like the movie AG. I don't know what movie that is, but I watched it. I love Idris Elba. I feel like that verse is very Wale. I feel like that whole silhouette was very Wale. Wale is like the underground rapper's favorite rapper. Like he he he's a great artist. Um, very lyrical. He said a bunch of things in there. I missed half of them, but I know they were solid. I don't know why we're going back and forth between. I don't. I I want to meet the Double XL guy to put this stuff together. Cause what are they doing? Half of it's silhouette faces, half of it's black and white, and half of it's not. I mean, I just, who who they give the creative license to on this? This was very haphazard. Let's get into the next one. Let's see what we got. We're going to add here. Joe Biden has spent his whole. Oh, shit. I leave a nigga like holy smoke star. All right. Yo, I did yo. Oh, God. I, I am just, like holy I'm destroying this video. Yo, I did yoga right when I woke up. Yoga, the Roth. granola, soy milk, diet soda. Don't drink it no more. It's bad for you. Yo, I'm so de delighted because I'm such a, a white kid. I like it. It's cool. Where's the mic at? Let's duel. Nah, not yet. Let's put Soldier Boy on and watch the white kids. You go school. Yay, books. I like chess. I take your rook. I like breasts. I'll take a look. Won't say nothing to you, but friends you on Facebook. <laughs> come on, guys. Come on, guys. And he got the exact response he should have got. What? <laughs> what is this? Okay, so as the Roth, for y'all that don't know, had the I Love College joint, which is still one of my favorite songs to this day. That song was awesome. I love college. I love drinking. That's that song was great. This was bad. This this was not good. You know what? Uh, yeah, let's do it. We're gonna, we're gonna run this again. This was bad. I mean, this was probably the worst one yet. Let, let let's run it back. Yogurt, fresh fruit, and granola. So I did yoga right when I woke up. Yogurt, fresh fruit, and granola. Soy milk, diet soda. Don't drink it no more. So if y'all peep game, the guy directly in front of him with the big shoulders and the. Widow's Peak are uh, I'm not going I'm not going <laughs> His haircut's bad I'm going to say that He knows every line of this And look how excited he is It's bad for you Yo I'm so de Delighted Cause I'm such He's saying the lines I like kid I like it <laughs> Yeah yeah but yeah yeah <laughs> Nah not yet Let's put Soldier Boy on And watch the white kids You Go school Yay books I like chess. This was bad, man. I like breasts. I'll take a look. Won't say nothing to you, but friends you on Facebook. <laughs> hey, look, look, look. All the black people were like, because mm. <laughs> it was even the white dude is like the Mi magic Mike looking dude is like. Mm. Uh, so I'm going to say this artists. If you ever get a chance to do anything, show your face. Okay. Why wouldn't you show your face? This is so... Somebody from XXL had a stupid idea to get, like, portions of the artist. Here's the thing. And obviously, XXL got way better at this as the years went on because the current ones are fantastic. They have a little cipher. They have everybody around. You get to look at all... They, 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 they figured it out. This is trash, though. And this is next-level trash. They let them record this on their own and send it to them. And as the Raw thought this was going to be, somebody should have told him. You had bad friends, Aster. This is not good. Asher, sorry. Yeah, that's trash. All right, let's get to the next one. Corey, Corey Guns is hard. Corey Guns, son of Peter Guns, who's got like 47 kids. Corey Guns is dope. So I'm excited for this. I leave the nigga like holy smokes, the holy ghost. After the holy smoke, you be a holy ghost. Chromey toes, homie pose, get their baloney rolls, fold the macaroni molds before I ask the lonely rope. Phone me hope on these quotes. Fuck with me, be mummy's only lonely hope. Dull as phony soaps. I knew a nigga who dreamed the flying boats, then he drowned in. 
<laughs> dull as phony soaps. That's hard. They thought because they made his hope float. The white bubble soft, so they make the coke float. So much niggas could throw a parade with coke floats. Some tote toast and try to promote close, and those chose do with a die like vote quotes. You sex, you running with dicks in your coach choke. My click hole thicker than goat coat, so you'll be dead ass, no joke. Call me a shooting star or your bitch's babester. Hopping out of something like a Nilla way for cakester. Like, ha, <laughs> man meets machinery equals injury. Comprende? Fire torch since 14, 15, they pinched me. Unfortunately for mother who didn't abort me physically. Mustn't hurt his history. His shit has been mythically sent in by descendants of wizardry. This gets the industry. It's twisted instantly and hit me frigid cryogenically. Now I feel abilities that cripple clinically. <laughs> to eat him sees the trick for healing me. I pull up in the super radical, holy smokes with the mackerel opposite tactical to laugh at you. Why? Cause it's practical, actual fact is that you will rap with us half the matchable tackle to capture capital, acrobatic compatible. Fucking cabbage, I get cactus, touch this, it gets medical. Save the hypothetical and theatrical shit for Steve Wilco shows before these drums roll back. Steve Wilco's. Okay, <laughs> it's so funny that these two came back to back. He was literally the opposite of what Asher Roth was. Asher Roth was like, hey, this is stupid. Don't rap anymore. He's like, bro, you 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 gotta dumb it. You lyric he that that was a lot. He said something about holy mackerel in the middle of the voice, the verse, and I was about done. Corey Guns is special because he has that back to back flow where every single thing he says rhymes triple time. Like it, it's ridiculous what he can do. But it's almost overkill. And that's why I think Corey Guns didn't last. So from this list so far, the only people who have lasted, Wale, and who was at the beginning? Um, I feel like somebody in the beginning lasted. I can't remember. We're getting deep into this. But Corey Guns didn't make it because there is such thing as too much. And it's not comical enough on an Eminem level where it works if you have too much. So that's why I think Corey Guns didn't make it. Blue. Oh, Blue. Blue and Exile. That's dope. Yo, say, say, who says I cannot build Rome in one day? Again, why aren't you showing the artist's face? This is his chance to make a, a, a fan base for himself. And I'm looking at the top of his head. Who the hell thought of this? Thanks, now move out of my way, peep. You better not be them niggas left screaming help me. If you wanted to be free, all you had to do was tell me. Guess who? I'll be a sky captain, I I captain. Fly guy lamping in the clouds like the Hamptons from dark Los Angeles, but brought up so scandalous where everybody hands be in the sky like the champions. Joe, my tone alone, leave your microphone damage. Wrapped up in the bandage, been the ambulance is raw and uncut. Candyman shit, chick say the name once and get cut. Panic, fucking up this planet, smoke till it's plantless. If it equals bucks, I give a fuck what the plan is. Either making cake or I'm trying to make a sandwich using either lettuce, bread, or cabbage. That's it. Using either lettuce, bread, or cabbage. Bling nice, bling long, John Slight, sting pipe dreams. I reach for daily, stone daisy, daydreaming about Bone and Jay Davy. I dream about bread, lettuce, cabbage. Blue has a blue is nice, man. I think blue is out of Michigan. I might be mistaken on that. Blue, blue can rap. Blue can rap. It makes sense that he was a part of this. I just think that he never figured out how to cross over into making commercial music. I think he's dope. He's an underground rapper. He's an underground rapper's rapper. You know, kind of similar to Wale. I want to go. <clears throat> I want to go back and see who 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 it was earlier. I don't even know Mickey Fax. Let's try this. Yo, I'm the incredible, multi-dimensional, ultra to rescue you. Yo, I am so fly in that gold five. I drove by impeccable. Holes like my testicles don't bite my vegetable. <laughs> Wait, I'm hilarious. Holes like my testicles don't bite my vegetable. I can relate to that. Break up nice marriages, make you vicarious. Hey, I'm so fabulous. They say I'm arrogant, but name another rapper since Keen is extravagant. Try harder than that, argue it back. The drill sergeant and rap with film. All of you cats run laps around my camp till you fall and collapse. I still bark on you raps. Yo, chill, doggy, relax. Nah. Ridiculous lyricist, still militant, diligent, skilled gentleman. Mickey's the real Gilligan, frivolous, killing these little idiots, real serious. I'm sicker than the clitoris filled with real syphilis. I'm serious. I'm sicker than the real 
clitoris, their their real clitoris filled with real syphilis. Mickey Fax was kind of nice. Does anybody know a Mickey Fax song? Is there something I can go look up? Never heard of this man before in my life, but he can rap. Again, why are we filming his eyeball? I know I need to let that go, but this whole thing just. Oh, God. All right. Currency. I know cur- currency. Currency had has, has a pretty good underground following. He's made a lot of money off of being a, a weed smoking, relaxed rapper. He has a good flow. I like currency. Let's check it out. Pull up in that new shit, pop my poop at Ruth Chris, get a plate to go and hit the dough and keep it moving. No tin on my windows, let them bitches see straight through them. See me inside it, I know exactly what I'm doing. Mama, I don't hide it, I just show it to them. Dad attracts them to me, then I don't have to go to them. White and yellow Diodorus feathers in my Stussy fedora, Hawaiian shirt, print floral, Carrera twin turbos, our Lamborghini Toros, stunting on you niggas when I'm in there take your whole mode don't want to shot a Quervo but we could burn some purple at the crib I got the RK version of Ninja Turtles <laughs> RK version of Ninja Turtles is dope my problem with this is he, he spit a song verse for a was supposed to be a freestyle so Wale Mickey Fax um, there was two others that really understood what this was about uh, even Charles Hamilton, to some degree, understood what it was about. His just wasn't that good. But if if you get a chance to spit a freestyle, don't spit a song verse. It's not it like it, that. Clearly, sounds like it belongs on a song on a particular beat that you wrote that to. I I didn't like that. And now I don't know what kind of lead time they give these artists. Um, but a lot of them squandered their time. Uh, okay. I don't know how much is left here. We've been going for a minute. Let's see what's next. Go ahead. Yo, me and Charles Hamilton, we handle that like the handlebars. We swerving off guard. Take guard, motherfuckers, take guard. We go hard, motherfuckers, go hard. <laughs> Sink or swim, yo. What it is, y'all. I don't know what I'm saying, but I'm having a ball, y'all. Because XXL invited me here. Except I invited myself by being crystal clear on these raps. When I tell them, I tell them I don't. Send them to hell them, I tell them, yo, rel them, rel them. What's the rel of them? Revel them, revel them. Except it's um them, so the gum is them, so the see. I can say anything and it still sounds high. I don't care if you like, you saved it. Or like me a lot. Because me and Charles Hamilton be handling them. Like I told him, so go ahead and handle them. Yo, hats off to Ash Roth. Now it's time for me to blast off Ash Roth. Not stop, not stop, drop and roll. I'm on top of the globe. I got a fat knot in my pocket. I got a gold glow. Leroy, like that D-boy. Last Dragon, quit asking. These half-ass faggots rapping on the track. Should get blasted back in the time when I rhyme. Hey, you couldn't say that nowadays. You couldn't say that nowadays. I'm off the mind, I shine, and I'm feeling so fine and dandy. These bitches seem to find me to be candy. I just be <laughs> Wait, wait. Yeah. Find you with candy? That sounds like you're a child rapist. But I won't hold that against you, Charles. It's okay, kid. <laughs> me and him be going back like the pages in my book when I read history's wages and say how that's crazy that they didn't give these poor people a chance to make it. So I take my dollars that I I make and give them back to charity because you know how I be. I barely be on this MTV, but they let me in anyway because I am white. Not because I can rap or I got a bite because I bark louder than I bite. I just. So now we know why Asherah Ash- didn't make it. He knew what it was. Talk a lot of shit, but I don't give a fuck. I flatten your upper lip and put holes in your shirt like Mickey Faxes. Uh, you know the faxes. This is that wax shit, but it's not wax. It's not written on wax. This is just some facts spitting off the top. Yo, it's flows from the earth. Yeah, the holes in my shirt, but I still got to rap. Yes, you know that I'm first standing next to Hamilton. Damage anybody. I don't care if you're Chinese, American, or African. Throwing javelins, they traveling straight to your abdomen. So if you get caught with it, then I'm having it. And it's a rap for them. I'm up here 
Carjacking anybody on con hair, freestyling with my man. He was kind of nice. Hair, yeah, what's going on, Ashton Roth? The nasty boy, that's why every time that I rap and floss, cats be looking at me. Damn, Mickey Fax the boss. And you are the employee, shorty. Uh, might be bossy, hot and glossy. Yes, and so flawlessly. Bracelet on my wrist, so it's like it's in my vein, man. Face it, you a bitch. And I still got the turntables and I burn labels. You ain't nothing, you can't even wear fables. So what's going on? I'm about to pass it on like a marathon. This is the decathlon, because you ain't having it. Yeah. It's like a marathon. I'm in the Guinness Book of World Records because of the rapathon. I'm rapping on any track these motherfuckers say they was blacking on. The Millie, what's really? Motherfuckers silly. I'm incredible. These other. Not gonna lie, I'm done with this. All right, man, what y'all think of that? That was a long video. I want to go back through some of them. I want to see who all I had here. I scroll up here. I'm doing. I'm doing a lot of work here. Don't don't mind me. All right, I got you. So I want to say, Cuddy was weird. Bob was dope. Ace Hood was actually one of the better ones. I want to say my favorites. Ace Hood was one of my favorites. One, my favorite ones. Uh, Corey Guns was insane, but I don't know half of what he said. I'm not gonna lie to you, but it was fire. I think Mickey Fax was actually my favorite from all of these. So getting into the WXL. Freshman class, Cuddy, B.O.B., Ace Hood, Charles Hamilton, Asher Roth, Corey Guns, Blue, Mickey Fax, and Currency. So the biggest artist that even still exists in a large format to this day is Wale. I think he's like probably the, the, the gold standard for this class. B.O.B. coming right behind that. Ace Hood after that. Ace Hood still has a pretty good file, I believe, out in Florida. Uh, Corey Guns had a good run with Young Money. Asher Roth had 10 seconds. Currency has had a good run. I think he's done work with the homie uh, Dom Kennedy. I think they've done a tape together. He had a good run with Cash Money. But, yeah, Wale is the only dude still making music out of this class. So that's 11 years ago. So shouts to Wale. What do y'all think about this? I'm going to be bringing y'all every class. This this kind of video is probably reserved for real rappers who really are into hip-hop and, and have followed the XXL joints. Let me know in the comments below. Who you thought was the best one from this class? What songs do you know from Mickey Fax? Please tell me. I want to do some Mickey Fax joints. Um, yeah, let me know what you thought about this, man. We're going to be doing more of these because I just think it's dope. What happened to Charles Hamilton, man? He should have been great. Let me know in the comments below. Join our live stream Saturday night. ESMR Avengers. Send your music through ESMR 0775. We do react to freestyles. We react to songs. We review your music, give you good feedback. Catch us Saturday nights, 8 o'clock Mountain Standard Time. And, uh, yeah, man, if you enjoyed this, get the thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Become a Avenger crew member. And tell us which of these artists you know music from or you like. We are the Smart Avengers, homie. We'll see you next video. Peace.